What's going on, Geminites? It's your boy, Gem Mint. It's your girl, Pete. If you're new to the channel, this is the What's in the Box segment. This is where we open up mail that comes from you guys, the viewers. Sometimes we get stuff from companies. Sometimes we get stuff from artists. We don't really know what's in these boxes. Sometimes they're just nice letters. Like this one right here, which we did actually open up. Because we didn't know if it was like hate mail or what. I was kind of nervous because it was very, I was like, yo, is this somebody sending us a picture of our dress again? <laughs> <laughs> this is from DJ Lynx in Brooklyn. He just took his time to send a quick little note. And he's tempting me with stickers. It says, Gem, big fan, real recognized real. Thank you for inspiring me, DJ Lynx. Real yo, he could have sent that in an email or a PM or whatever. But yo, he took his time to like mail a letter. That's super dope, man. Yeah. Nice. Appreciate that. Thank you. What do you want to open first? Um, I think you should open... Can we get some of these big boxes this out of the way? This is not Amazon. Yeah, so this is definitely not Amazon. It, so, you know... <laughs> this is from Daniel uh, Benmoha in Weston, Florida. Ooh. Our old stomping ground. Oh, yeah? Hold on. Is this supposed to be for us? Yeah, Stephanie Fever what's in the box. So I'm Yo. scared of what this is. Yeah, I'm kind of freaked out. Okay. Oh, it says, Dear little Timmy, we are so sad we couldn't be for you, be with you on your sixth birthday. Uh, we miss you and hope that we will be with you next year. We thought that it would be nice to give you a birthday present, even though we didn't see you. Uh, may our love always be with you, Tim. Love Grandma Gail. But you see how he did the, G the gem? Oh. Yeah, he used a lot of tape for sure. Ooh. God is Dead by Hickman trade paperback. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man Worldwide Volume 1 trade. Uh, Su Superior Spider-Man, what is this? Of oh, the Arms of the Octopus crossover event trade. DC Entertainment Graphic Novel Essentials. And the Manhattan Projects. This is the Deluxe Edition Volume 2. Mm. So that's in the first little... Uh, Bundle? Yeah. <laughs> Let's see what's in this one. But yeah, I mean, we use a lot of this stuff for gem crates. That's why we don't sell gem crates. Yeah. Because it's all like donated stuff. Yeah, I can't sell them. Ooh. Ooh. These are so this is random comics. I like the lenticular cover, though. Ooh, I like this next one. This is my Ooh. kind of cover. This is an old school Invincible Iron Man 97. Ooh, yeah. Old school Adam. Just looks like a reader. Uh... That one Hulk looks, 600. That looks flagged. Yeah. This looks like it's been flagged. These have been red flagged. <laughs> These are red flagged. This looks like he got mystery boxes from well, Comic Tom. This is though. a nice cover. So just randoms, just reading material, nothing crazy. James Bond, Guardians issue one, Battle Cats, Spectacular Spider-Man, Blackest Night issue eight. That one looks cool. He likes random comics. I do. You would be the one that would be a good mystery box customer. Oh yeah, I I love all of the um, the older covers like these. Yeah. The new ones are nice, but this is my this is my jam right here. What is this? Detective Comics one thousand. There was a million variants of that. Oh, I like this reprint lenticular. Luke Cage, uh, Silver Surfer looks like a reprint. True Believers. I love the True Believers. Is this is where the samurai stuff comes from? Batman Samurai? I don't think so. Dark Knight. Legends of the Dark Knight. Man Bat number one. New 52 from the year of the villain. Justice League. Some Deadpool comics. This looks like the stuff we give out in Gem Craze. Alright, cool, man. Appreciate the thought. Thinking of us. Packing this up. Your little labyrinth of goodies. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to enjoy that. With the, the decoding of the message. <laughs> All right, cool. This box. Wait, this one's a mystery. That one's like a super mystery because I don't know where that yeah, this came is. It from. says it's from David Richmond in uh, Malvern, Pennsylvania, right? Yeah. What the hell? What's in that bag? You can have this bag. <laughs> <laughs> what? This is awesome. Yo, this is a Spawn Hot Toys. Let's look at the letter. Oh, my God. Hot, I mean, Hot Wheels. I thought it was a slab at first, but I was like, it feels weird. Now, let's look at the letter. Yo, Gem and Fee. I'm a proud card-carrying member of the Gemini community, East Coast chapter. For the record, I found GMC via a happy accident since 2016. I've thoroughly enjoyed the reviews, unboxings, live streams, updates, specials, guest appearances, discussions, etc. There's hard work put into every video. Trust me, it shows. 
On that note, your buying advice has been spot on. It's helped me build my personal collection through flipping hidden gems found in the wild. Uh, yes, indeed. Make the collection pay for itself. Here's a token of my appreciation. A little mystery box of random geeky goodness. Stay safe and minty fresh. Respectfully, Dave. Ooh. Awesome, man. Appreciate cool. that. Thank you. It's two packs of Topps Batman cards. Sealed. Oh, you like that kind of stuff. I know. I'm like, why are you not handing that to me? You and have the turtles ones like that. Yeah, let me see. Oh, I can feel the gum in it. I'm so going to eat it. Yeah, so check this out. So, special limited edition Spawn Mobile pack. It comes with uh, a Spawn Issue 7 in the pack with it. Super cool. Sealed. Spawn is like one of my favorite characters, man. He's in top five for these sure. These Batman ones are from 89, and the Spider Man ones, these ones are cool. These I like ones are cool. this uh, oversized, like, magazine edition Batman trade, uh, Son of the Demon. 92, the McFarland era, is what it says. Oh, and then he's got Batman Bride of the Demon hardcover. These are older books, too, man. Yo. I think there are 10 cards in each pack. Not like these days. They hit you with the three cards in a pack. Yo, I'm super excited. There's pris they could have a prism card in it. Oh, yeah. Is that, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, this one is still sealed, too. This book has got to be an old hardcover, man. Cool, man. Appreciate that, Dave. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. These are so cool. You want to open one? I feel like I'm opening all of them. Um, yeah, I'll open this one. All right. There we go. <laughs> Who's this right. from? This is from Javier Pedraza. This oh. name I've seen. Javier's in the chat, live chat all the time. All the time. Oh, yes. Someone yes. shops at IST. Yes. Thank you for reusing. This is empty. Oh, my God. This is exactly the kind of package I wanted to open. <laughs> Snacks? This is exactly... <laughs> oh. oh, yeah! Well, he, he hit me up. He was like, yo... I sent you guys this before I saw that you guys ended up finally watching The Crow. Yeah. We watched it for the first time, though. We appreciate the thought, man. Dang, what is all these? Candy sticks? Yo. Oh, superhero candy sticks? That's, first of all, now they're called candy sticks. When I was a kid, they were called candy cigarettes. Cigarettes. Oh, sour. Oh, he knows what I like. Yeah. Appreciate it. Yo, we're going to be all hopped up. Sugar Rush. <laughs> yeah, our kids are going to be so happy. Yo, those goobers, pop those open now. Those are chocolate covered peanuts. Oh, we got a whole snack crate we're supposed to be doing. Ooh, I'm so in the snack mood. Okay, so uh, I want you to cut this open. Javier, thank you, man. Yes, thank you. That's so Babe, cool. Babe, you're going to cut the desk. This yeah. desk is perfect in mint condition. No, it's not. Ooh. Everybody always talks about this Ooh. this uh, war wound on the desk. What? What is this? A bunch of memes or something? Of this. Oh, my God. Hold on a second. A Krusty the Crown sticker. These are Krusty stickers the Clown. And, These are stickers and magnets. Bill and Ted, magnet. Oh, look at Friday the 13th. It's got... Um, Shoebox, like Tupac. I can't say these people's names. Oh, that's Friday. Yeah, they're like hood movie like parodies, like Tennis to Society. <laughs> oh, look. look at here's the crown. Well, hold on. Are you seeing what this shirt is looking like? I swear, it's, well, first of all, it's not even going to be my size. It's 2X, so it's kind of in the middle of us both. Three Knuckle Productions, you got the Sideshow Bob shirt. Yo, these are so cool. There's so many. Look at... We can't... Probably one of our kids can wear this. Oh, my God. This says Ice Cubicle, and it's Ice Cube <laughs> yeah. and a work desk. Yeah, they're all like memes. Or that's that's interesting, man. Hey, appreciate it. That shirt is dope, man. If he loves The Simpsons, we're both big Simpsons fans. Yo, C3POG. All right, I think this is just a package for me that I bought. All right, so I ordered these from... My one of my favorite place to get shirts online, T Public, and I, I wanted some shirts for some statue reviews I have coming up. So I got a Robin statue coming up. So I just I got the best looking Robin shirt they had. Yo, they have this patch online. So Robin the boy one. There wasn't really a good selection of Robin shirts. Then this one I was gonna wear it for my Superman Dark Knights Return statue, but it came in before the shirts. But I like this Man of Steel. This is like oh. the Steel character emblem. That's cool. I do like that a lot. I like That's like my era. Then we got Oh, Silver Surfer. I got a Silver Surfer. This is the Mobius cover. Ooh. I got this because I'm going to end up getting this Silver Surfer statue to review. Ooh. Even though it's going to be a minute. And then uh, <clears throat> I got a Harley Quinn shirt so I figured I'll go animated series with it. For when I get the Harley statue. Ooh, yeah. Oh, what? <clears throat> oh, <laughs> for your bag? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We're not buying shirts for you to make bags. Yeah, you are. Okay. What are you doing? Trying to bust over some Twizzlers? Yes, I am. 
<laughs> Here you, you can cut. All right, so this is from our peoples over at um at uh, Dynamite Comics, and I'm not really sure when this video is gonna air, but we have our first exclusive variant with Dynamite with a Vampirella book. Uh, we have it on Indiegogo. Go RSVP, or if it's already live, buy some. Uh, so, oh. oh, packing peanuts, Vincent. So I know what this is. This is a Vampirella statue, uh, Jose Gonzalez. Now, what's dope uh, with Dynamite, we actually have a code where you can save 10% off anything on dynamite.com or dynamicforces.com. The code is GEMMINT10, all one word. So this is going to be a statue that I'm going to review, but we'll just show you guys a quick look at it. So it's a 50th anniversary limited edition statue. Vampirella, how fitting. We got the Vampirella variant coming out. Maybe we'll do a review, and maybe we can even use this as like an incentive to get to a certain tier on the Indiegogo campaign or something like that. Mm. Do you know which one is inside of this one? Is it one of the colored ones, or is it one of the black and white ones? I don't know. I think it's the regular. Let's see what's in these little packages. All right, so in addition, they sent us some comics, and these are all things, these are all like Dynamic Forces variants. They have uh, COAs on the back. Uh, this is a Champions one. You know, I didn't even realize that Dynamic Forces was Dynamite. I remember Dynamic Forces when I was a kid, man, doing variants and like doing, uh, they, they did special CGC slabs with um, CGC. So they all have COAs, Action 1000. I like that cover. Little TMNT 100. Dang, appreciate that, man. So we'll definitely use this stuff for gem crates as well. You know, we don't really typically keep the stuff that we're given, so... Awesome. Shout out to Dynamite, man. Hope that um, you guys hit that site up. Use the code GEMMIN10. You can save 10%. Lastly, we have a poster tube. It looks like the real deal. Hold on. Let's see who this is from. This is from R. Bogner. Oh, my from Cali. gosh. He's going to love this. What is He's it? He's going to love it. Show me. All right. Here we go. You're going to have to help me pull it out. Oh. You're going to have to help me dang. pull it out. What? Yo. Wait. I, oh. For the statue picture? Yo. What do we? What can we use this for? He already has it on here. It tells you what to use it for. Oh, they're both stickers. Oh, it's for the turntable. Dang, it's for the turntable. <laughs> oh my god, that's so cool. I love that. What? And our turntable is dirty as hell. You're gonna. He's gonna ruin this. No, no. I'm gonna let you apply it. I Wait. know, but you're. So when you put the statues on it, you're gonna tear this up. Dang, thank you. That's so thoughtful, man. I love That's that. So wait, hold on. Look at the look at the tube. Who's it from? I said I just said who it was from. Oh, sorry. Yo. So that's everything, man. Wow, appreciate everybody who sent something in. Uh, so thoughtful and um, man. You That's got me? cool. No, thank you. It's I, 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 every time I'm surprised. Yeah, man. Make sure to subscribe to the channel for more what's in the boxes, more daily content reviews. What else do we do? <laughs> we just review stuff. Uh, and hit the playlist for our other... I don't have this in a playlist. I should make a What's in the Box playlist. Are you tripping? Why do you not have a What's in the Box playlist? I'm going to make a What... By the time this thing comes up, it's going to have a What's in the Box playlist. Stay minty fresh. Peace.